my chessy inspired look. Leaning into shorts this summer. Most feminine. Trying to avoid my tote bag. I don't like fringe normally. Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. My name is Jamira. And in this video, I wanted to share what I plan on wearing this summer. It's getting warmer. Summer is like a f maybe a few weeks away officially, but we're already in that zone. And I have been accumulating things for the summer. I've been getting ready for the summer. Style-wise, you know, clothing-wise, shoe-wise, all that stuff. Uh, so I wanted to share just a few outfits that I'd wear and like what scenario I'd wear them in. I have like a color palette that I'm leaning into, trying to be more adventurous. Not that adventurous, but just a little more adventurous. And I'm really looking forward to being outside this summer. So yeah, let's get into the first outfit. So this is a sort of brunch look for when it's not too, too hot, but I uh, was thinking of, I really love this orange blouse from J. Crew. It's like a gal, a gal's print. It so feels summery. Um, it is like breezy too. It's not, it's not a heavy material, I would say. Uh, and then I'm pairing that with my shiny by nature denim jeans that I recently got. These, I like have to cuff them just for the look of it. Otherwise it would look a little weird. I'm not the best at cuffing, but super leaning into shorts this summer. Um, and I really like these so far. So definitely gonna be bringing these out this summer. Um, and then on the bottoms, I have my Oliver Cabell sneakers. Um, so yeah, this is for like a casual brunch vibe, like the sleeves like rolled up. Uh, if I want to do, I feel like I could get away wearing this for dinner. And if I did that, I would change my shoes to like a more fun zany shoe. So like my camper heels, my rubber ones. So for more casual, just like running errands in the city, you cannot go wrong with a t-shirt and shorts or jeans. Um, so I am wearing my Target graphic, like Pixar um, t-shirt with my shiny by nature jeans and then pairing them with my black Tevas because we're, we're taking it easy, you know? Um, for a bag, oh my gosh, I have it used my Brandon Blackwood in systemic racism bag in a long time. So I would definitely pair that with this, um, you know, for a little bubble tea outing, a little browsing, shopping sort of vibe. Um, or to bring out like the blue in the t-shirt, I would wear my crochet my like bubble bass crochet bag which is so fun it has such a nice texture um just to add some pizzazz to the outfit um i am trying to avoid my tote bag because i feel like i use my tote all the time um especially last summer it was all i wore and i have a like a big bag collection <laughs> so i want to use my bags but this is the look, a very, very simple, fun, fun day. I wanted to do like a dinner, day, night sort of look. Um, so this is the Target Alani collection um, dress. I have one in tan and then they have one in brown and like this blue color. I was so close to getting that cream dress, but I have a cream dress already and it didn't make sense for me to get another one. So I ended up going for like this bluish multicolored dress. I really like the fringe details. It feels the fringe. I don't like fringe normally, but the fringe on this dress just felt really summer appropriate and fun and I like that it's like at the bottom so it sort of has the sort of I guess mermaid quality to it in a way I don't know um, and then I am pairing it with my camper shoes which I think really pulls out the 
pink in the dress um, and just adds some playfulness as well. Then I'm pairing it with my vintage wood bag, wooden bag. Honestly, it was, I don't really feel like I have a bag that fits this outfit perfectly. Um, so I think this would probably be it, but honestly, if I'm like, since it's a, a, a date night look, you know, I'm looking to not really pack a big bag because I'm, I shouldn't be paying for anything, you know, I, <laughs> I just need my phone and my keys and I should be something that, that fits just that. Um, no, but <laughs> this is the look and I'm not mad at it. I feel like I'm not mad at it. I feel like it looks very defined. I actually really like it with my hair back. Um, and yeah, this is it. Bear with me. I know that this outfit is very wrinkled, but it's linen and I don't know what, I feel like that's expected with linen, but this is like the most relaxed state type of outfit. I feel like I, I call this my, my chessy inspired look because I know that look is like super trendy. Um, but it is a good, it's a very good look. Um, I really, I, this is, I'm, I'm leaning really into the neutrals here. Um, so I'm wearing, uh, the, this linen top from, I think it's from Target actually. Yeah, this is a linen top I got from Target. I think this is a Gabrielle Karifa Johnson collection. Target's have been killing it lately with their collection. So I just gotta shout that out. Um, and then I'm pairing that with these trousers, these linen trousers that I got from Red Dolls. I had to get the pants hemmed, which was my first time getting anything like tailored. And that was a really good experience. So I'll definitely be doing that again. Um, but yeah, I, I feel like just tying it, like not even tying it, but just like wearing a button, one button is nice. And then maybe like tucking it, tucking it in on the side here maybe like i think playing around with the styling of this could be fun um or maybe even doing like everything tucked in okay so i feel like doing doing a tucked in look will make make it even more like refined looking i think uh, and then i would wear this like clutch bag that I got from Portmanteau, a vintage store, so it's a vintage bag um, that I'm like feeling to wear out so I may like, I don't know, I feel like I may want to wear this outfit today, but yeah, I may do um, this like little clutch bag to like go out, run my errands, like keep it well casual, and then I'm just pairing them with my Javianas, so these are like the, the platform Javianas. Uh, really loving these flip-flops they feel really comfortable and they just I they they go so well with a lot of my outfits so that is the look um, I actually love this this is hands down the most feminine outfit I would say um, but this is like a really great picnic outfit you know you got a picnic day with friends why not show up with gingham you know i feel like that it immediately screams gingham you know uh so i'm wearing this shiny by nature dress i am like really loving that brand um this company they had um a sale like the whole month of may and i went a little crazy uh, but it was really worth it. Uh, the pieces are like really great quality, um, or like really good quality. It feels so soft, this dress. And then it also has pockets on both sides, which is really exciting. Um, I also just love the skater, um, the skater dress vibe and just how flowy and airy it is at the bottom. So it feels not constricting at all. Uh, I would pair that with this vintage bag. I'm really leaning into 
pinks and reds and like oranges this summer so uh this is this fits the the vibe i'm like really just trying to be a walking valentine you know gotta attract some of that energy you know so uh yeah this is fit real simple i am wearing uh a pair of like sandals i got from target i am on the hunt for really nice sandals not necessarily flip-flops but just really cute sandals that you can dress up um preferably not too fat uh flat so if you have any recs for where you do your sandal shopping let me know because i'm i'm sneaker queen and i'm leaning into like the flat the the flip-flops but i would like a nice like elegant sandal so that is what i'm wearing got these on from target and i feel like they really just they add to the look a bit so that wraps up all the outfits thanks let me know which one you like the most and i will see you next time thanks so much for watching bye she said she the one i bet she thinks she is Sand on high, no trust, I don't know where you been I need a break